Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my corner of the internet. My name is Jason, and today we're back with some more Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. Alright, last time we uh, took a, um, a Thieves Guild quest against the Mages Guild here in Alderaan, and I think that may have been a mistake, because I think, I think our ability at thieving is a little bit low. Um, because honestly there's a few different chests like this one here that's at uh, lock level 75. And uh, I can't get into that. I've basically gone, I've gone back through the entire place uh, several times, um, you know, trying to, uh, to loot different uh, chests, unlocking things, uh, you know, doing what I can to kind of try, you know, try to, um, to try to find this, this, this dagger thing. That's, it's, that's interesting that my sneak has increased while he's, uh, he's, uh, you know, s taking swings at me. <laughs> I have vanished. I've blurred away. Uh, I, I like this. Uh, I like this ring. What, what, what is that? Like two to three percent? Uh, let me see. Where's my blur ring? Yeah. Oh, three to four percent. That's all it does. But yet, for some reason, it throws people off. Very cool. Very cool. Anyways. Uh, so, uh, you know what? I think we're gonna have to go ahead and, uh, you know, I'm curious. Uh, I, I, I don't know if I've ever done this quest before. Uh, and I'm kind of curious if uh, if I can't, don't get the, um, the dagger, will um, will the mage's guild go back to normal, or 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 is it stuck in this state until I complete that quest? Uh, and if that's the case, uh, that's kind of interesting because I kind of locked myself out of the uh, all the services and everything of the Alderun mage's guild, uh, and I I think that's kind of interesting, sad, uh, but at the same time very. Uh, sort of interesting, but you know for the time being I've got myself my little training buddy here who I can Basically just sit in front of uh, whatever I want and let him uh, try to wail on me I can increase my armor skill my my block skill maybe if I ever uh, Ever even need to block because this guy can't seem to hit the broadside of a barn Either that or I'm just dodging so amazingly uh, Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and try it. Let's try it for science. We're gonna step outside of um, is it done, I'm gonna step out and then we're gonna go back in, and I want to see what happens. He's still here, uh, and nobody else is here. No. Okay, so I guess the Alderaan Mages Guild is now is off limits there? for the uh, for the time being. Oh wow. Okay. Well, then what we're gonna do is, um, hmm. I guess we'll. Go, I'm gonna run back over to the uh, the clothier, see uh, if we can talk about uh, what is it, In Innis Sarandus? Um talk about you know his uh, unwillingness to pay uh probably like what i'm going to end up having to do is going ahead and persuading him um you know using my speechcraft skill to try to get him uh to to uh pay up uh even though i did technically uh rob him uh -uh. um but uh so that's a th that's what i think we're gonna have to do uh but uh yeah for the time being i'm just gonna go ahead and see just we'll say talk to uh talk to them again and see if uh Oh, it wasn't. It wasn't this one. It was the other clothier. Ah, uh, okay. Give me a second. I'll, I'll be back right when I get back to that person. All right. Yeah, th I'm pretty sure this is who it was. All right. I'll talk to her. I'm pretty sure she's gonna be like, hey, have you done it? And I'll be like, no, and she'll be like, okay, then go ahead. You haven't completed the quest. What do you want? Oh, shh. Um... Yeah, so basically... Work? Yeah, so basically... Uh, either recover and return my amulet, uh, or extract the overdue payment. Oh, the amulet! I could go ahead and get the amulet back. Oh, I don't remember seeing an amulet in there. I, oh, I could have tried just stealing it. Well, I, I, I'm a dork. I really should have uh, paid more attention to things. All right, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the rat in the pot um, and uh, get this. Wait, do, do I did I get rid of the bounty? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I already took care of that. So let's go to his place um, and then we'll, we'll see if we can try to get the amulet uh, back. If not, then, what oh, well, we'll... I'll probably go back to maybe go back to Balmora uh, and do some questing there. Uh, probably some thieves guild. I, I need to really build up my um, my uh, my skills as a thief. All right. Um, let's, let's use the blur ring and head on in. All right. Now, where would he keep this amulet? 
need to find this amulet. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Okay. Um, we have that unlocked chest. You know, he's probably got it on his person, to be honest. Uh, or... No, this is stuff that's on paper. Um... Desk. I already looked in here before. Closet. Yeah, he probably has it on his person. Um... Alright, well, let's go, let's go ahead and try and, um... Pickpocket the guy. No, he's gonna walk close to me. Okay. Thief ring. Blur ring. He had, he just has to face the same direction here as as me. Okay, let's let's see if I can sneak around behind, uh, and pickpocket the guy. No, I don't want. I want to still gonna take his pants. Uh, nope. I, I I'm pretty certain he's got it on him. I can't think of any other any other place that it would be. Now, now, every time I do that, is that, uh, that's gotta be doing some, something for my sneak here. Uh, let's try this again. Thief ring. Blur ring. Alright, let's try this. No. He doesn't have it on him. So, is it hot? Is he hiding it somewhere? And I've already, I've already extracted the 50 drakes from him. So it's not like he can exactly pay me back because I, I pickpocketed pickpocketed him last time. Um interesting. Alright then. I uh, haven't been able to figure this one out yet. Let's see, is he hiding it in any of these urns by any chance? Yeah, it doesn't make sense that it would be in a sack or anything like that, but I figure, you know, just in case he's hiding it. Just in case, you know, he's like, uh, oh crap, people are gonna be coming for my stuff. I better hide things. But it does not appear that, um, he has the amulet. Alright, let's try one last time here. No. Alright, let's head on back to, uh, Balmora. What have we got up there? Is it maybe in a bat? Oh, oh I, okay, hold up. Sorry, sorry. I was like, wait, what if it's inside that basket? He's got a basket up there. But I can't see what's in the basket. So I want to jump up on top of his his oven or his stove thing here. His furnace thingamabob. His little mini kitchen. I, I, whatever. He, whatever this thing happens to be, I want to climb up, try to get up on top of it. I don't know if I can. I should be able to. Okay, give me a second while I, I fiddle around with things. Alright, I basically just moved the basket. While he wasn't looking. Alright, so there's nothing here. We're gonna head back to Balmora. Now, we obviously Outland. obviously can't what teleport back because we um, we kind of uh, locked the uh, the Mages Guild down. So what we're gonna have to do is go ahead and take the, uh, the Silt Strider. Or I could manually travel back, but uh, that actually would not be a terrible idea because that would take me through uh, uh, Caldera. And Caldera would allow me to sell some things. Hmm. That... Does sound like an interesting idea. Uh, do I have something that I would really, really want to sell though? Like a lot of the stuff that I want to, I want to sell, I, I basically dumped already. Oh crap! I just thought about something else. The where is it? Yeah, I got to run back into the Mages Guild one last time. I, 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 I realized when I was was emptying out my um. Uh, my inventory that I, uh, I I had taken a certain piece of paper and dropped it in uh, dr dropped it down in the, one of the side rooms. Now, if we go ahead and we look at quests and we look at a House Halu disguise, um, I spoke with Naminda in Aldrun. She gave me a scroll to deliver to, to Margan. I should deliver the scroll to N Nileno uh, uh, Dorvain in Balmora instead. I took that scroll and I placed it. Yeah, that's right. Here, I dropped it. So, I need to run back and grab that scroll so that I can deliver it. Um, back so that I can complete that quest line, uh, you know, back in, uh, back in Balmora. So, for House Lalu. So, let's go ahead and... I'm not here. Go away. Uh, tax record. Guide to Aldrun. Oh crap, it's, it's underneath something, isn't it? Darn it! <laughs> 
<laughs> he's laughing at me. He's like, ha you screwed up. Uh, all right. Well, the directions to Chaos Crusades. No. You've gained knowledge from this book. Your block skill increased to seven? How does that work? Identify your chapter. Didn't I, didn't I need to look at this book to be able to pick it up? Oh, I might have looted it from a chest. Not long now. Oh, well, that's cool. Uh, no, it's not there. Directions oh, to case is at hand. Or maybe it's underneath. Yeah, alone's directions to Balmora. No. Nope. Interesting. And I actually have room. In, I actually have inventory room. <laughs> I love that the guy's just sort of swinging away at me, and I'm just like, not right now, guy. Not right now. Where is uh? Where's the, okay? Guide to Aldrun. Please don't tell me I already had it on me. <laughs> Nimid his orders. Ah. Uh, this is this is not start you know this is a very bad playthrough. I don't like the way this thing started off. Hmm. All right. We are uh we're heading out again. Uh, I decided I was going to go ahead and travel because I wanted to build up my athletics and my acrobatics. Uh so I'm going to be jumping my way back to Caldera. I also wanted to stop by and um meet up the, with the creeper uh to maybe sell a few things. Um because I'm if I if I recall correctly, the creeper will actually give me I think it's either full value or I can't remember, but uh, either way, he's got a lot of money, and I figured, you know, I could, I could go ahead and do that. It's not going to take me uh, too long, you know, provided I start traveling in the correct direction, uh, which it already looks like I'm off to a uh, fabulous start with, because I think I'm heading in, I think I'm heading in the wrong direction. So if, let's, if we take a look at the signposts, uh, Margan, Alderaan, Buckmoth, Buckmoth, yes, Buckmoth, Legion Fort. Uh, I think that path does hook uh, back down south. So if I look at my map here, there's, but I'm kind of wondering if I should just head south. Whatever, we'll, I'm going to head south and we're going to adventure our way back to Balmora where we're going to go ahead and maybe do some more uh, thieves guilding, uh, I guess, uh, because I, I really want to build up, oh, there's somebody else on the side of the road. That means it's going to be another quest that I'm going to have to get myself involved in because, hey, there's people on the side of the road and I need to talk to everybody. book I've ever read. That was the strangest book you've ever read. All right, tell me about the strangest book that you I have only read. I have a few moments. All right. You there. Yes, you. I'm in need of an escort. You'll do in a pinch. Awesome. Yes, I, 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 I'm ecstatic. I need an escort to Ghostgate Shrine, and I need to be there in two days' time. I'll give you a tip when you get me there safely. I haven't got all day. Shall we go? Ugh. All right. Well, we can't say no to a quest. I will escort you there if I must. Good, let's go, and be quick about it. Where's the ghost- where's Ghostgate Shrine? <laughs> Can't you tell me where that is? Uh, yes, I need to get to Ghostgate Shrine. The shrine at Ghostgate is a symbol of, uh, Almzivi's, uh, indomitable will and power. Something you wouldn't understand. It is located within the ghost fence. Within the ghost fence! We'll pass through- We'll pass through the ghost gate and head northeast. Here, I'll mark Ghostgate on your map so even an idiot can't get lost. I, I love her attitude. She's like, uh, wow. Yeah, okay. Uh, so we've got to go to all the way to Ghostgate. Wow, okay. Well, we, we definitely got, we we're definitely getting sidetracked, uh, this time here. Okay. Well, let's, um, let's get to traveling. Come on. We've got to get you to your place because you, you're, you're being nice and snotty about it. Um, but you know what? It, this is going to take us through new territory anyway, so this, that's great. Uh, it's nice to see that I, uh, I run faster than her. So, you know, when the cliff racers come, uh, she's, she can be nice, well, uh, and, uh, behind me when I need to start, uh, zapping them. You won't escape me that easily. Please, you wanted an escort? Let me do the work. You're just gonna get yourself hurt, or get in the way, or some other, yes, cliched phrase that t you typically see in, uh, a movie that, d uh, that revolves around an escort. No, man, you're only gonna get in the way. Stay back. And then they go ahead and they try to get involved in, and then they, everything goes to crap. Don't get involved. So, yeah, anyways, I guess we're gonna go ahead and do this uh, quest. This will take us... Dang, this is gonna get dangerous. I really wanted to drop off some of my uh, my gear. I wanted to go ahead and sell some stuff, but I, I guess we have, a, we have a time limit. Um, she says two days time. I don't know if that's uh, how strict that is. 
Um, I, I suspect that it is somewhat strict. Like, they, they are going to uh, hold me to that uh, that time limit. So, that's why I'm like, ah, uh, okay, I guess we'll do it. Besides, it'll, it'll allow us to explore something different. Uh, you know, kind of move around and be like, hey, look, there's something uh, new there that we can go ahead and explore. Like, um, we could go over there. There's a clan fear, though, so I'm, I, I fear that the, I, I may be a little bit underleveled to uh, take on the likes of one of those, but... Yeah, let, let's, uh, we're gonna go inside the ghost fence, because, um, sure, I like terrifying things. And, and blight disease, and... Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, I am woefully under, uh, underprepared for this, uh, this quest. Uh, oh well. Come on, lady, try to keep up. There be cliff racers up ahead. So yeah, but we're gonna go ahead and uh, head up towards the uh, the the giant ghost fence and uh, by the ghost gate. And oh, here comes another one. And I've got what eight charges left. Um. All right, let's see. You won't escape me that easily. All right, so he's coming. Yeah, there we go. I, I don't think I'm going to have enough to actually take him out. Yeah, I, I'm going to need a better uh, ranged um, enchanted item. Um, and you know what? Until I have the chance to, please put your suggestions for a name for an, uh, uh, an enchanted item that does damage at range. I don't care what element it is. Just put, put it in the, the, the comment section. No one can match me. There we go. Lady, I, I I did all the work. Just just. All right. Um. So yeah, I'm actually a little bit I'm a little bit nervous about getting uh, to uh to a ghost gate. I I I think this will say accepting quests when I'm not ready to accept quests thing is uh is is going to uh, get me in trouble. Uh. So. All right. Now I I, I hadn't wondered. I, I should I should have uh, asked. Well, I can't. I didn't have the option to ask her. But I was. I'm kind of curious, why does she need to get there? Like, why does she need to get to this ghost gate uh, shrine? Does, is anyone else asking this question? Why? What does she intend to do there? Ah, oh, crap it. You won't escape me that easily. Uh... Oh, call oh, crap, 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 crap. Um... Oh, screw it. Just pull out this one. There we go. If I can draw its attention, then it won't be hitting her. Oh, please don't let me hit her. Because that would really suck if I accidentally hit her, and then that basically uh. fails the entire quest. Oh, uh, that's, that's one thing I, I hate about escort quests. Okay, we're good. We are good. Because if I, the, the, the AI won't, uh, it won't distinguish, you know, between, oh, you accidentally hit me and... You know, you, uh, you, you're, you're trying to kill me. She will just turn me, uh, turn on me on the spot, and then it will all be over. Um, what I'm going to do, you know what, I think it's probably more beneficial for me to, uh, to sort of try to sneak past everything here. Uh, then again, th th we'll say that, that'll make my, my travel a lot, pretty slow, actually, so I'm not sure. And it's, I, I, oh, it still, it still goes after her anyways. All right, so maybe that's not, uh... Oh, screw it. We're just gonna run. We're gonna fight everything along the way. Cliff racers and, um... Well, mostly cliff racers. All right, so I, I don't believe I've ever taken this path towards, um... Ghost Gate. Actually, you know what? It, it looks familiar. I, I think I've been here, but I don't think I've... We'll say taken it as a path to uh, Ghost Gate. Like, w w you know, while exploring, I may I may have come across this, this place, but... Uh, it's, uh... I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm fabricating memories. That's possible too. People people fabricate memories all the time. And, and, and when I say fabricate memories, I don't mean like, um, you know, I, I'm not I'm not lying or making up stories. Uh, it's you know sometimes you just you honestly it's like um, you think you remember something so hard that you, in a way, you start to. It's like you 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 begin to believe it, and or you you do believe it because it, it's like. You've you've created this sort of it's, it's I guess it's like unintentionally lying to yourself uh, because you're like oh yeah I I totally did that when in actuality you may never have done it 
Um, I'm, I'm explaining this very poorly. I'm sorry about that. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, I'm all over the place, uh, with my thoughts today. So here we have a bull netch. Now, if I recall correctly, these guys are not, they're, they're pretty passive. The female ones that will attack, uh, attack you if you get too close to them. So, uh, but the bull ones, you know, we can, uh, the males, we can go ahead and run past them without, uh, too much issue. Uh, I have 10 charges for my taser, and I'm going to use them all up here. Uh, my letter, my light armor skill is increased to 27. Now, I wonder if I can use Thunderfall here. There we go. I'll take all. Alright, I think we're almost there. Uh, now, oh, darn it. Cliff Razors! Uh, it looks like there's a small camp over there that I could stop and uh, chit chat with the the people at, but I'm not going to uh, not going to do that because I <sighs> pointless. Give in. Oh, I don't have my spell out. Um, like I said, I want I want to get this this quest done. So, <gasps> no, I zapped her. I totally zapped her. Darn it, she's gonna want to. She's going to want to kill me now. Darn it! Please be careful. Or maybe you know, I'm, I'm really hoping I'm remembering wrong. I'm really hoping that she's going to that she'll she'll forgive me, and then we'll just carry on business as usual. Oh, please, please, game, please, game. I've come this way. Yes. Okay. Maybe I'm remembering wrong. Maybe maybe Morrowind is a little bit more. Uh, well designed than I gave it credit for. Who knows? Um, come on, lady, let's hurry up and get you to the ghost fence before we're beset by more cliff racers. Cause I could, I could see them and I'm like, oh, they're gonna come. All of them. Alright, we're, we're, come on, we're almost at the, uh, we're almost at the, the ghost gate. Itself. Now, Ghost Gate, uh, interestingly enough, when I first played the game was, uh, one of the first places I discovered because there's actually, um, it's on the signposts. No, no, that's right. I was trying to find Balmora. My first time playing the game, and I, I think I obviously I had taken a wrong turn or I missed some signposts, and uh, uh, that led me here to uh, Ghost Gate uh, rather than to Balmora. So I'm wondering if I should just. Uh, no, we're still quite a ways from Calder Caldera, or was it Caldera I was trying to get to? Anyways, I was trying to get to a certain uh, city, and uh, we can go ahead and hit, hit the switch I don't know now. This. I like this. Yeah, I know it's uh, it's uh, nice and scary. Now there are uh, little paths that you can go in here. There's a, a bit of a, there's some shops you can uh, visit, uh, some supplies you can get uh, inside of these uh, structures off to the side. But you want to hit the switch if you actually want to enter uh, the ghost gate. And it's kind of set up like an airlock, if I'm remembering correctly. So we come on in here. Where are you, lady? Come on. Uh, then we basically hit this switch here to open that. Uh, that one there. Yeah, and then it closes that one. Uh, a very poor airlock, because uh, an airlock would have, uh, closed, uh, the, the door we f the first came through first, and then opened up, um, this one. What the heck have we got here? Alright, well, I'm not looking forward to fighting anything in here. Oh, so we've got cliff racers, and we've got, uh, zombies! Zombies! Alright. With you long enough. Uh, all right, we're gonna go ahead and no, 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 no. Oh. What the heck? Please be careful. Sorry, sorry, sorry. A corpus stalker. Now the corpus weeping with a value of fifty, I think I'll take it. It's disgusting. I don't. I'm like I don't want to grab this crap. Um, but uh, all right, we now find ourselves in the Red Mountain region. Now, she said northeast, right? Um. Let me see. Uh, we'll pass through Ghost Gate and head northeast. Here, I'll mark my, uh, the location on uh, your map. I like I like the, the the note here in our journal. Although the trip shouldn't take too long, I have a feeling it might seem that way. I like that because uh, I, I'm I'm guessing it's a, a commentary on her um, her uh, her attitude. So we're gonna head up northeast this way through the uh, the area of Red Mountain. Actually, it's kind of cool that we're getting a chance to see this uh, this early in the game. Uh, we, I get to kind of uh, show that off. Uh, although I am uh, concerned about my 
uh, companion's uh, health at this time. I do- that's another thing I do like about uh, Morwen, when you have like a storm, let's say if I don't have a weapon out, um, if I'm not sneaking, um, oh, okay, maybe it's- maybe it's not working so well for me, but you'll notice with her. Oh, crap it! <sighs> Cliff racers. Come on, come on. Um, they'll, they'll hold their, their arms up in front of them to sort of, uh, shield themselves from the, the, uh, the wind. And I think that's actually a really cool, uh, it's really cool addition. She's not doing it right now. Oh, there it is. There it is. So I guess we have to be uh, on certain terrain or, or, like, I don't know. What's taking so long? I need to be there in the next day and a half. Hurry up, would you? Interesting. Let me, uh, okay, I, I was kind of curious to see if my, uh, journal would actually, uh, indicate the time. But it doesn't look like it, it does. Um... Is this- is this it? Holy cow! No one can match me! Take that! Oh. This round. Uh, yeah, I think I've got this. I'll just keep slashing on this. I'm pretty sure she's off to my- my- my left based on the sound. So I don't think she's going to get in the- let's say in the path of my swing. But my short blade has increased to 48, so that's great. Alright. This looks like a shrine thing up ahead. Please let this be the shrine thing, because I, uh, I, I want to get out of here. I want to, I want to be able to go ahead and uh, do my, do my regularly scheduled things. All right, lady, here you go. Your, well, we've arrived. Surprisingly enough, here's your tip. Now leave me. Hundred gold has been added to your inventory. That's it. Can I talk to you again? <gasps> oh. I- I could, uh, pickpocket you. <laughs> I forgot that I was sneaking. Uh, you are no more you- uh, you are of no more use to me. Be on your way. All right, lady, fine. Be- be- be that way. Now, since I am... who I am... Uh, let's see here. Darn it. I- I want to- I want to- I want to see that money again. She's gonna- she's gonna get upset with me. There it is. You've made your last mistake! Did, now, did I get it? Did I get it? I, it sounded like it took the money. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got the money. No! Yes! Ha-ha! You can't catch me! Dun-da-da! <laughs> oh, this is gonna come back to bite us later in the game. We're gonna come back here and she's gonna be waiting for us and all ticked off. I don't, I've forgotten about her. Go, 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 go. Hit the airlock, hit the airlock thing. Oh crap, she's right there. Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. But the ah! <laughs> Lady, I brought you to the place. Oh, this is great. This is great. Uh, all right, so she's gonna chase us like all the way back to wherever we're going. Uh, honestly, I should have just uh, cast Calm Humanoid on her. Uh, actually, you know, that's probably a better idea. Let's lead her back towards the Ghost Gate. And then cast, uh... We'll see the Calm Humanoid on her. And then we'll, uh... We'll try to, we'll try to get away. And you know, I find it, I find it interesting that now she's able to keep up with us? Like, really? Like, before... She was, uh, she was struggling. We had to sort of stop and wait for her. And then... Oh, no. Oh, no, she caught up. Ow! Ow! Oh, I've got no fatigue! Oh, Hold you. Holy crap! Okay. Oh, crap. Die, she, uh... Scoundrel. She might get me here. That's that's you uh, won't escape me that easily. That's kind of funny. All right. You won't escape me that easily. Oh, it's a cage match now. All right. <laughs> Holy crap. All right then. You know what? Uh, give me a second, people. Me that easily. Holy crap. Uh, she's really hurt. I don't know if I want to. Uh, give me a second. You're not even trying. No, I'm not. Um. I don't know, I've got this thing about, I don't want to, uh, needlessly, we'll see, kill characters 
Uh, there we go. Calm humanoid. I, I've got- I waited until I got my fatigue up. I used Ancestor Guardian to kind of... And I failed casting the spell. But you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try to refill my... My, uh, Magicka. So let's go ahead and where's my cheap restore Magicka? Drink one of those. Just to give me an extra- uh, give me a little bit extra, um... Magic. Uh, I need 23, so that was definitely not enough to restore enough Magicka to go ahead and cast the spell. Uh, wait until there, there we go. Aw, oh, darn it, she, she drained some fatigue. My chances are gonna, oh, no my, you, you can see, you can see my, my, uh, my, uh, my chances of casting just dropping. And, uh, you know, I, I don't even have enough magic to cast the spell anyways. <sighs> Holy cow. Uh, come on, lady. I'm trying to be nice to you. I really don't want to have to kill you, but I guess I'm gonna, I, I guess I, there we go. You're calmed. Just let me out. Let me out. No, 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 no. This one. This one. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Darn it. Darn it. I've opened the, the wrong freaking door. Ah! The things we do for the sake of role playing. No one can match me. All right. Go. 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 Uh, now what I want to do is I, I've gotten the, the calm humanoid on her. You know what? Apparel. We need boots of blinding speed. And we're going to head to our local map and run. I want to get away from her before the spell wears off. Yes, I will escape you that easily. And I'm off. We'll meet her again someday. I don't know why I didn't just resort to this uh, earlier. There's no way she's going to be able to keep up with me with the boots of blinding speed. There we go. T basically taking the same path we took before. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we've got her out. Uh, we, we, we've, we've outrun her. She, like, we'll probably meet up with her again, because she's going to give up the chase. Um, eventually, once we at least get, like, I, I want to say, at least one cell away from her. Um, so, yeah. We're going to go ahead, and I'm going to run back here, and... Oh, seriously? Cliff racers? Is that, is that why I have the, the hostile uh, music going right now, is because cliff racers are all chasing me? Yeah, that's probably it. Um, all right, let's 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 come on. We can do this. I'm kind of scared to t turn off the um, take off the boots to see uh, what's what's behind me. <sighs> Light armor skill has increased to twenty. All right, I'm fairly confident that we've put enough distance between uh, us and uh, the lady. So let's deal with this stupid. Pterodactyl thing, and I need to turn off my map. Uh, all right, let's try last wish. Oh, and there's a rat too, because sure, why not rats? I kind of like uh, I kind of like the sword. There we go. Was that it? All right, and there's relative peace. Now, uh, you know, what? I'm really not crazy about this entire recording. Like, a part of me wants to just go ahead and re-record everything, but. Um, I'm not going to. I'm not going to do that. Uh, all right. I wanted to get down to Caldera. I'm going to. I'm going to get to Caldera. Uh, I'm not sure which way I'm going to take though. Uh, I could uh, cut through this, these uh, Daedric ruins. But if I come across like a, a little dungeon area that I want to go ahead and explore, you know what? Screw it. It's part of the adventure. Uh, I am unfortunately out of time, I just noticed though. Uh, so I'm gonna have to cut things here. Uh, I feel like we, we kind of just ran around all over, all over the place, but um, as is, well, that's, we'll say, the nature of uh, uh, the game. Uh, I am curious though, my blade. I noticed uh, the bar is a little low. What's the condition? Yeah, it's actually, uh, looks like its condition is pretty low. So this this sword is uh, is damaged. Well, we will need to repair that. Uh, luckily, if I recall correctly though, we did get some repair prongs, so. We'll go ahead and uh, repair that really quick uh, while I'm doing my my little co closing spiel. Anyways, uh, so yeah, next time we're gonna go ahead and cut through the um, this sort of Daedric ruin area, and uh, we're gonna work our way down to sort of Caldera, Battle Mount Mora. Uh, and my goal right now, it's probably gonna be uh, to go ahead and uh, cash in the, the House Hlalu quest, uh, as well as um, maybe do a little bit more Thieves Guild stuff uh, in Balmora. 
uh, in hopes of building up my security skill. What I might also do is pick myself up a lock spell, um, so that I can lock doors. Uh, one, we, we, we saw how that could be helpful, you know, in the, the last uh, video. Um, but, uh, it'll also allow me to practice my lock picking. If I can get myself, like, a low-level lock, um, uh, lock, uh, uh, spell, I can lock doors or lock chests and then unlock them myself to, uh, to build, develop my skills. But anyways, uh, we're done for now. So if, uh, you like the video, you like the content, and you would like to see more of it, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, go ahead and leave it a thumbs down. Either way, let me know what you thought in the comment section. And until next time, I'd like to ask you all to game on. <laughs>